Okay, class, today we're going to do a little bit of a review, but then we are also going to learn how to use mean, median, and mode in order to compare two data sets. We are not going to be doing range and MAD today. Okay, here's a set of data. These are grades for a class test that was given at some point in the past. I don't even remember. First thing, let's make a dot plot. Since everything is by fives, I'm going to go by fives. Uh, the minimum so far I see is 75. Nope, there's a 65, so the minimum is 65. That means that I will start at 60 because 60 is less than 65. The maximum is 105, so I will end at 110 because 110 is more than 105. The start should always be less than the minimum, and the stop should always be more than the maximum. So, 60, 65. Notice, I'm going by fives. I'm not going to skip anything. I haven't bothered to see if there are any 65s or 70s. I'm just going to list go by fives, ignoring what the data says right now. I already know that I'm going to go by fives. And I've done it. I've made my line. Now I need to put some dots in. I'm going to change colors just because I feel like changing colors. Okay, 95, dot, 65, dot, 105, dot. Notice they're all lined up horizontally. 80, dot, 75, dot, 85 dot 105 second dot 75 second dot still lined up horizontally uh, 95 105 105 100 95 80 95 95 95, 100, 70, 105, 75, 105. Okay, so now let's find the mean of the scores. All right, there's 165, so I'll put 65, plus 375s, plus 280s, plus 85, plus 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 95s, plus 2, 100s, plus 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 105s. Take out my calculator, see what that total is. 65 plus 3 times 75 plus 2 times 80 plus 85 plus 6 times 95 plus 2 times 100 plus 6 times 105 is 1,935. That doesn't mean I'm done. I need to now divide that by how many there are in total. 1935 divided by 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21. I get an average, a mean of 92 and 1 seventh. That's the mean. Okay, median. Well, 21 is an odd number, so I'm going to use the median rules for odd numbers. I'm going to do 21 divided by 2 is 10 and a half, and that rounds to 11. So I find my 11th dot in the dot plot. Change colors just because. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. I did 1, 2, 3, 4, Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. 
I circle that dot, that dot's value is 95, the median is 95. Okay, now the mode, well, let's look at these again. Which ones have the most dots? 95 and 105. So, there are two modes. Erase those lines, they're extraneous. 95 and 105. How do you know? They have the most dots. And that's review for you. That's how you find mean, median, and mode. Okay. Now, what the mean, median, and mode tell you is... How well did this class do overall? Well, 92 and 1 7th, 95, and 105 and 95 are all very good scores. That tells you that this class did well overall. Does it mean that everyone in the class did well? No, one person at a 65, that's barely passing. A couple of people got 75, they have probably have some questions. But, overall, the class did well. Now, let's compare this class to another class. They had a mean of 80, a median of 75, and a mode of 100. Let's compare. Mean of 80, comparing with a mean of 92.7. Did this class have a better mean, or did this class have a better mean? Well... 92 is higher than 80, therefore the first class did better overall. So you could say first class. And the way you know is the mean is higher. Let's look at median. Median of 75 for this class. Median of this class, 95. 95 is higher than 75, so you could say the first class did better because the median is higher. Now let's look at mode. Mode also tells you how, what you, how they did overall. 95 and 100 comparing to 100, well... Which one did better? It's hard to say, because although 95 is less than 100, 105 is greater than 100. So, you could say, I can't tell the median 95 is less than 100, but... 105 is greater than 100. Do you see how there are three different answers to this question? It depends upon what you look at. All three are correct answers. You could say the first class did better because the mean is higher. You could say the first class did better because the median is higher. Or you could sell, say that you can't tell which class is better because the medians are mixed up. One of them is lower, and one of them is higher. Oftentimes, you will get more than one answer, and that's part of this lesson. Okay, let's see how you do on the worksheet. See you.